morning. This is Matthew Hoffman with another episode of Do-It-Yourself Airstream. Uh, here we are inside a 1963 Globe Trotter, and we're taking a look at the cabinetry in this unit. What you'll see here, these are actually the original cabinets. We've since reconditioned them to, um, you know, we, we fixed a couple panels here and there, but we've kept the integrity of the frame. Um, inside, what used to be here was some, um, some solid panels, which were made out of masonite, I believe and they were sliding panels, they went back and forth. What we have now is we've actually kept the frame, we painted the frame, we've even kept the hardware, which is aluminum hardware inside, they're just two tracks that allows panels to run back and forth. And you can see here we've taken plexiglass from our local Ace um, Home Improvement Center, or any hardware store for that matter, and the plexiglass we've sanded on both sides. And this allows a nice look, we're going to create some lighting behind it, to give it some, uh, it's actually going to become a light for the entire room. And we've drilled a couple holes in each side, which allow us to put your finger uh, and operate the panels back and forth. And I find this is a great, simple solution that looks really nice, and quite, quite frankly, it functions really well. Okay, these cabinets, much like these overhead cabinets that we painted green, these are original, believe it or not. And you can see that the integrity of the wood was actually very good. It looked terrible. If you could see it before, uh, we have some pictures that I'll show you. Um, these are new cabinet doors. They're just plywood. Um, I believe it's ACX grade architectural plywood. And they've been sanded and routered off on uh, four sides, painted gray to match. Um, simple hardware uh, to install in this unit. And a lot of times people take a look at Airstreams and say that the cabinetry is just simply beyond repair. Um, but I find that's oftentimes not the case. If you have an older trailer with actual wood, genuine wood cabinetry, um, take a close look at it and look at the structural integrity of the wood itself. Is it rotted? Is it falling apart? Um, is it just a matter of the joints coming apart? Or is the integrity of the wood itself been compromised? If there's still some integrity of the wood, Chances are you can replace a panel here and a panel there, do a lot of sanding, some caulking, maybe some bondo, and have a nice new looking cabinet with nothing more than some refinishing and some paint.